Welcome everyone back to the channel. Hope that you're having a lovely day out there as always. Thank you for being here on this beautiful Friday morning that it is the end of the week. Anyways, you already see the name, the title in the video here, so you already know what we're going to talk about. Uh, I guess in a way it's some sort of a badge of honor, but not the kind of badge that I want. Uh, I have finally, I guess after five years of doing this channel, I've finally received my first copyright strike here on the channel. I don't want to make this like a really long video. I just want to like hit some quick key points. I even wrote down like notes so I remembered what I want to say. Um, but remember like how when we've done like live video reactions to like a live show with video and stuff, how I always said like, I don't like doing these too much because there's two, two areas of copyright, the music, but also the video, so it kind of doubles the risk. Well, that's, that's kind of why I don't, <laughs> I don't like doing those videos because it was one of those that uh, caught the, the copyright strike. Now, if you don't know, which I'm sure you guys probably do by now at this point, if you get three copyright strikes, your channel is gone. Like, deleted, it's gone, that's it, that's the end of Just JP. So, obviously, a, a copyright strike is not great at all. Um, so, the copyright strike actually happened on January 6th. I woke up in the morning to an email, and I, I saw the email that said I had a copyright strike there. Um, so, the first thing, I guess, that, of course, everyone has on their mind is who, who made the copyright strike, you know, who struck the channel, what band, what artist. I know that that's, like, the, the big question. Everyone wants to know that. I actually am not going to tell you. I'm not going to reveal what band, what artist did it, uh, because I don't want to. I, I, I'm trying to handle it privately between myself and the band slash label slash the owners of the music. And to be honest, I don't want to have a lot of people going to the band, going to the band's videos, emailing them about you know the issue or anything like that like that i'd rather just kind of keep it private i'd rather myself try to handle it on my own i don't want the band to be brigaded with a bunch of stuff and you know take away from them that's just me I'd, I'd rather not maybe if it you know maybe in a different situation maybe but for this I, i'd rather just try to handle it privately not bring attention especially negative attention towards the band or the artist i, I just don't i don't really want that so um i'm not going to reveal who it was or anything like that um, I don't want a bunch of brigading and stuff like that. For now, the channel continues as normal. You guys will not notice a difference because you haven't noticed a difference because like I said, I got the strike on January 6th, it's the 26th now, and I've kept it to myself just to see if I can work things out, etc, etc. But there won't be a change on the channel for the foreseeable future, so, you know, like I said, you don't, you won't have to worry about anything. Now you will start to notice in February and March, I will start editing more videos than I usually have. Uh, I'm, I'm being risk averse because <laughs> I really don't want to get to second or third, of course, copyright strike. So um, you're going to see more edited videos, not a lot more, but you will see a few more edited videos. And kind of like what I said before with those live video reactions, will there still be live video reactions on the channel of like, you know, concerts and stuff? Probably. There, there probably will still be a few. But it's, it's not like I was doing a lot in the first place, but now it's definitely going to be less. And for full live video reactions, that's now only going to be on Patreon. That's not even going to be public Patreon. That's going to be, you got to sign up for Patreon. I, I just can't risk it at this point. I don't want to. And that's going to be for the foreseeable future. That's, that's a change that I'm putting into effect right now. Obviously, like I've always done with songs that get blocked or anything like that, that will not change. That's always going to be open publicly for anyone. You don't have to sign up or pay for anything. That'll always be there. But live video reactions, that will now be basically a perk of signing up on Patreon. And that won't be available to the public. Kind of like how we already do that with like movie and TV show reactions and stuff like that. Like that is a Patreon perk this will kind of move to the same because like i said i've been doing this channel since 2019 i have nearly 3,000 videos 3,000 videos guys at this point and all that can just go away uh you know quickly so i'm sure the other question that would be asked is you know what does happen if if this channel was to i really hope not get deleted or anything like that well, it's not like I've been working on a backup channel hidden somewhere with a bunch of videos that I've been slowly uploading anywhere on YouTube. So I don't have that. I don't I don't have that. So anyways, uh, nothing will change <laughs> on the channel for now. 
uh, that you'll notice. Uh, everything will move along smoothly. Um, and also, this comes at a not great time because even though it's good news, I'm in the process of possibly moving within the next two months, my wife and I. So, uh, which is a good thing that that's actually good news, but this thrown in kind of complicates things. So, uh, you would think that like, you know, the copyright strike and all this stuff going on, I would slow down the content. <laughs> um, here's what we're actually going to do for, for at least February and March, I'm going to up the content to two videos a day to two reactions a day uh, instead of just the usual what is it 11 per week or so we're just going to go the full 14. i'm also you won't really notice but i'm just going to let you in behind the scenes reveal the curtain a little bit show you oz but i'm going to be pre-recording a little bit in case i do end up moving and that way you guys still have content rolling out to you so anyways that's it now uh, that's that's the update i uh, just wanted to keep you guys in the loop let you know what's happening of course, thank you all so much for the support, for all the love that you show on the channel and for being here and watching the videos and for listening to the music alongside with me. Um, to plug it again, if you want, it definitely helps out. If you sign up on Patreon, it, it helps me out, supports what I do so that I am able to do more because I don't plan anytime soon on stopping the channel or anything like that. So anyways, I just want to fill you guys in. Thank you so much for being here. I just realized I left my clicker remote to stop the video behind the camera. So uh, here's some space. Uh, before I go into the video. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta find it. I gotta find it. Okay. Bye, guys.